Hi, my friends. It's Nancy Bastine. And I thought I'd come on and um, show you how I'm going to seal these envelopes because you know they're watercolor. So I have this Spectra, Spectra Fix spray. It's made out of milk. See, it has a cow on it. And this, I've sprayed the other two, but I thought I'd come on and show you how I'm going to do this. And then I'm going to dry them and do the other side. And then I'm going to, after they're dry, then I can put a, a decoupage gloss sealer on them. So I'm just spraying them just like that. Put my lid back on that because this, this thing kind of gets clogged a little bit. It was clogged the other day. I had to soak it. So I'm going to dry this. I'll be back when they're dry. Okay, I sprayed both sides and dried both sides. I hope, I hope they're dry. I tried. I can see this side is not completely dry. I'll be right back. You don't need to sit here and watch me dry it. I'll be right back. Okay, they're dry. So now I'm going to get a brush and I'm going to decoupage this glossy stuff on there. And I should pour this out in a little cup so I won't have to keep dipping my brush in there. That's going to be enough. And let's hope for the best, okay? And I think it's going to be nice and sealed for anybody who gets these. I will write a note in them and tell them they're sealed. That they can use them however they want to. That uh, Spectra Spix really does work. And I don't know, you know what, I think it was Shannon Green that... that uh, found it and was using it on a long, long time ago. I've had it for a long time. On some of her things that she was making that weren't sealed. And um, I tried to make the stuff that Stacy made. But I don't know if I got the measurements right. Okay, so that side is pretty much sealed. I kind of have to wait for it to dry before I can do the back. But no paint, none of my paint ran. So that stuff really does work. And you get a gorgeous piece of art. So, I'm going to give this a quick dry and then we'll do the back side. That will be right. Now that I have it all sealed, and decoupage I don't think is sticky. I think it's Mod Podge that is sticky. But just in case this is sticky, gets sticky, it doesn't feel like it is. But I don't, well, maybe a little bit. But I don't think pages would stick to it. But just in case, I'm going to apply some Daddy Vans to it. And I have this Daddy Vans. I got it online. And I'm just going to put some on with this brush. This was another trick that... Um, Shannon Green, and she gets, she does commercials for Daddy Vans. I don't know whether she gets any royalty or not, but she does commercials for them. So I got that on there. Now, I got it on there really good. And I got the lavender kind, and it smells so good. I haven't decoupaged the backside yet. I just wanted to show you how I do 
this Daddy Vans. Now I'm going to take a little, I have a little piece of a, and I hate these microfibers. I just washed them the other day. So I'm going to take it and I'm just going to buff this in to my piece. I know it seems like a lot of work, but you know what? In the end, you'll be grateful that you did it. Especially if you're going to use these in a journal, page in a journal. Okay, it's all buffed in. And you have a nice, pretty page that smells like wax. <laughs> it doesn't smell like Daddy Vans at all. It doesn't smell like lavender. I'm going to have to put some essential oil on it. No, just kidding. So I'm going to do the back the same. I'm going to decoupage it, and then I'm going to put Daddy Vans on it. And when I get all of the other ones done, these are still drying from the spray. When I get all of these completed, I will be back and show you how they turned out, okay? I will be right back. took me a long time. I finally got them all decoupaged and got the um, wax on them. Now let me tell you, some of these are really shiny. See that? More shiny than that side. I'll tell you what I did. This Spectra Fix was still making my watercolor run a little bit when I decoupaged it. And I know I got it dry. See there? That is the spectra. So I went and got this mixture that I mixed up for from Stacy's Pink Poodle Crafts recipe. Well, she told us what to put in it. And I did that on the back of that one and on the back of that one. And then I decoupaged them, which I probably didn't need to do. And then I oiled them, and they got really, really shiny. Let me put the autofocus. Oh, it is. And they got really shiny. Really, really shiny. I don't know if you can tell. See? See the shine? More so than this one. See how it rubbed off my watercolors? It kind of smeared them a little bit. I wasn't too happy with that. But anyway, they're done and I uh, just wanted to come back on and tell you that. And uh, I'll take some pictures of it and they'll be on the back of the, on the back end of this video. So thanks for watching guys and going through all this process with me. I hope you enjoyed, and uh, they're ready to be filled with goodies and mailed out. So, thank you, everybody. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up, and subscribe, and ring the little bell. Bye-bye.